Ukraine representing right now, so <laughs> a proud moment right there. We move it along. Up next will be Khalid Al Zaid to take on Daigo Saito. And let me tell you right now, Zaid last year, he was one of the drivers that improved the most for me. This guy really put it all out there. But he has got a task on his hand right now as he takes on Daigo Saito from Japan. If you don't know what that name is, you don't know what you're talking about when it comes to drifting. Look at Saito though, very shallow angle, nose in the front of that Toyota Mark II, up onto the side of Zaid's BMW, but very close on the transition. And look at Saito as he edges the front wheel to the front wheel of Zaid's BMW. And Saito all over the side of Zaid, pushes him three wheels off track. Early transition from Saito, but look at the way he puts that car back up onto the side of the BMW. Saito, very careful, playing with Kelly Al Zaid right now as they come round that final front clipping point. Incredible stuff from Daigo Saito. So here we go, green light is go. Will be Kelly Al Zaid to chase down Daigo Saito for a spot in top 16. Look at this, Kelly Al Zaid onto the back bumper. But Saito way out of the outside zone. He falls off that qualifying line. Can he make his way back into it? He certainly can. But Saito trying everything he can to try to escape. Kelly Al Zaid right now, but big separation has open, opened up. As Daigo Saito puts foot to floor, looks for the outside zone, he starts to drive away from Zaid right now. As Saito finds the edge of the circuit, Zaid dropping wheels out the back, and nothing in it right now for Kelly Al Zaid. As Daigo Saito puts that car across the line. Oliver Bolton to lead, Daigo Saito to give chase right now, they come flying down, nice faint initiation from Bolton as he gets nice and close deep into the outside zone, Saito very very straight and a big error from Daigo Saito, anticipated the pace of the young man from Essex, oh Saito tries to shut the door, takes the back end off of Bolton's car, and Saito making mistake after mistake, he's panicking, oh he hits him again, Daigo Saito putting blows onto the side of this S13 from Oliver Bolton, Oliver Bolton looking strong, fires it into outside zone three, Saito Strong has to get up onto the door, but he's making a whole host of errors. Bolton keeps his call right now as he fires through that front clipping point and across the line. Wow, scrappy from Daigo Saito. Both trucks get the thumbs up, they get the green light. Saito gone like a scolding cat off the line. Oh, but he's crossed over the halfway mark. Daigo Saito using all that opportunity to weight transfer. Bolton shallow. Bolton has to drop way out of that inside zone. Uh, sorry, the outside zone to stay with Saito now as they come through. Bolton puts big angle at it. Bolton needs to keep his cool and stay in the outside zone as Daigo Saito does exactly what he's been doing in practice today. And that will put on a nice lead line. Oh, he's throws big angle at it. A huge mistake for Daigo Saito once again. As he slows down the car massively, comes around that front clipping point. And a huge separation opens up as they come across the line. International signal. Signal, sorry. It's going to be a one more time. One more time. So, uh, I'm going to throw it to you. One of the judges, you can pick this up. Oliver Bolton's car took an absolute battering from Daigo Saito. Saito landing blows onto the side of that car every opportunity. Both they've got the green light. Here we go. It'll be Bolton to lead. Daigo Saito to give chase. Once again, nice little flick initiation from Oliver Bolton as he gets nice and deep into the outside zone. No, no big mistake so far from Daigo Saito as Bolton stays nice and deep into the outside zone. Fires it up onto the side. Saito this time he knows. He knows where he went wrong last time. And he gets door on door with a young man from Essex. Now Saigo Saito starts to bring the fight. This is a Daigo Saito we've seen before, but he's way offline there. Gets himself well caught up as he fires back up onto the side of Oliver Bolton. Bolton drops the wheel, blows the rear arch off the car. Bolton stays in it though. Flicks that car through that front clipping point and across the line. Ready, he knows he can't afford to give Saito any room to move. As both guys fire down into initiation, much nicer from Daigo Saito. Oliver Bolton this time, you can see shallowing up ever so slightly, stays into that outside zone, but no proximity from Oliver Bolton, he falls way off. He just doesn't have the pace in that car to keep up with Daigo Saito. Saito on a clinical lead line right now, very, very nice. As Daigo Saito fires in to outside zone three, you can see just scrubbing some speed with that little Oliver Bolton. Nowhere to be seen though, just not got the pace in that car as they come round the front clipping points and across the line. Going on between there, here we go. So Daigo Saito now warms his tyres. Big blue battle with third place qualifiers. Oh, Talek Al Shani to take on Daigo Saito. Can Saito keep his form? 
as fire in, very fast initiation from Tarek. He knows he can't mess around. Oh, and Saito now left for the stand in a little bit. Makes a dive though. Saito starts to rein in the local man as he puts it to the side of the S13. Big transition from Saito right there. He has to get out of it and give himself room for fault now as he starts to put the wheel on the door of Tarek Al Shahani's S13. Now this is the Daigo Saito, but a big transition from Saito way in the wrong part of the track. How did he pull that off? I will never know. Front bumper, headlights, body panels, Saito off track. What is going on? You know, rocked in the car once again, just not after the weekend. There's a man out Shahani for a spot in the final four. Can Saito hold it together? Or were the mistakes in the first half of the run too much to be overdone? Oh, and contact from Shahani this time. Shahani puts it to the side of Daigo Saito. Everybody here not messing around this year. Panels getting blown off each other's car and damage left, right, and center. These guys have brought the fight to the Amman International Drift Championship, and nobody is going down without tooth and nail going at it. And Saito this time makes the transition happen, sticks that back wheel on the line as he keeps it just in track he's going to watch wide. Now Shahani makes mistakes on that front clipping point. Across the line they go. Both guys feeling the pressure. 